What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up any filter on Snapchat for your PC. Without further ado, let's get right into it. The first step you have to do is go to this website called snapcamera.snapchat.com. This is Snapchat's website, so there's no viruses or anything like that. And all you're going to do is click download. It's going to tell you the system requirements that you're going to need for your PC, but literally any PC should be able to work. All you're going to want to do is scroll down to where it says you have read the private policy and check that and then just verify that you're not a robot and then you should be able to download it. It's a pretty easy setup. It's just like any other program. All you do is click next, next, next. And if you want a desktop shortcut, you can do that here and then just click next and install. And now once that is installed, I'm just going to launch the program. And all you're going to want to do is click next and finish. So now that once you're in the snap camera program, as you can see, it picked up my webcam completely fine. But if it doesn't just go into the settings in the top right corner and then choose your camera here. You can also choose the camera resolution. And also you can set up your microphone because some Snapchat filters have mic filters as well. Well, I prefer removing the flip video preview because it's just weird, like you don't need it. And if you guys like to use hotkeys, those are all right here. And this is where you guys get literally any filter on Snapchat. So for example, I just searched up Halloween and now I got all these Halloween filters. And so now I'm a witch, obviously. And so now to set it up inside a program like Discord or OBS. For Discord, all you have to do is go into your user settings, then go to voice and video, and then all you have to do is change your camera to snap camera. And as you can see, there is no issue at all. If there is any issue, just close the program and open it back up and then it should be good to go. And it's really easy to do inside of OBS. All you have to do is go to your properties on your camera and then for the device, just click on snap cam. And if it doesn't work, you might have to change your video format. And then just like that, it is all good to go. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't already, please be sure to drop a like and subscribe down below. And other than that, I'll be seeing you guys later. Peace out.